Welcome to Legacy Week, a week where we will be revisiting six of Yu-Gi-Oh's oldest and most iconic sets. Each day, I will open a 24-pack booster box made up of 25th anniversary packs, starting with Invasion of Chaos and continuing in reverse chronological order. Each day, we will total the number of foils pulled and the total value. Which set has what it takes to earn the title of Legacy Week Champion? Let's find out together. Welcome back to Legacy Week Episode 4. I hope you guys have enjoyed the first three episodes. They have been insane, especially that last one. Go check it out if you've missed it. Don't forget to watch this video because today we have, not Magic Ruler, unfortunately, we have Spell Ruler 24-pack box. And guess what? Pharaoh Servant was crazy last time. I'm expecting this to do just as well. And uh, guess what, guys? These old boxes don't actually fit 24 of the new reprint packs. You saw this yesterday because the new packs are way thicker for some reason. I don't know why. I guess the cardboard's a little bit thicker on the cards. I would have expected it to be the other way around, but apparently the newer cards are actually thicker. So today we'll be opening a booster box of Spell Ruler to, you know, get hyped up for Legacy Week. Also, there will be these Spell Ruler booster boxes available for everyone in July. So if you want to pre-order some of those, check out the sponsor of Legacy Week and the 200k special, Sassiato, link down below. You can use my 5% discount code to get your stuff pre-ordered. It's coming out in July, so it's a couple months away, but it's going to be really fun. I'll be live streaming stuff like that as well, but this is kind of a preview of what you'll see there. We're also celebrating the 200k special, which is also sponsored by Sassiato. There's going to be a mystery opening upcoming. I haven't announced it yet, but it's going to be insane. 200k special video, and of course, a 200k stream all the way to 200k subscribers. There's going to be a lot of celebrations coming up, and this is just part of it. So let's go ahead and start off with the Spell Ruler opening. Out of this set, I would like to see Blue Eyes Toon Dragon, Relinquished. I'd like to see Toon Summon Skull, Toon Mermaid, stuff like that. Delinquent Duo would be awesome as well. There's a lot of really good cards in here. We've had some good ones so far in Legacy Week, and we've tallied up the total foils. I think last time we pulled like six foils, pulled five in Invasion of Chaos, nine in Dark Crisis, but Pharaoh Servant was probably the best in terms of value with those double Jinzo pulls. It was crazy. Turtle Oath. Let's see if Magic Ruler can be just as good. Queen Bird. It's going to be tough because that was really awesome. We have Sinju with the 10,000 or 1,000 ants, not 10, and Magical Labyrinth. Spell Ruler. I believe that you can show out because this is the only set that has changed the name from these three. I mean, we've had six different old school sets. They changed the name of the set for one of these because, you know, a little conflict with Magic the Gathering. We have Hungry Burger. Very nice. Peacock. We have a Labyrinth Wall. Dark Witch. Send you the 10,000 ants. Ten, same card and I said the same thing wrong. Thousand ants. I do like... Oh, there's the little brother. I do like the 10,000 ants, but you know what, guys? Send you is also a great card, okay? What's all with all this mind you love? Just send you is cool too, okay? Just because he has less hands, that's why you don't like him? I mean, come on. Is it, Do you really like people based on the number of hands they have? That's just weird, man. Okay, one, two, three. Let's go. We have Magical Labyrinth. Let's see if we can get our first foil. We have Plasma Zone. We're 0 for 2. We got a Kappa. Curse of Fiend. Hungry Burger, number two already. We have the Queen Bird. Stone Ogre Grotto. Giant Rat holding a skull. Very scary. And a Jigen Bakanun, a blow up bomb. You gotta be careful. Starting off with Ofer. This is kind of what happened in the Pharaoh Servant video, actually. We started a little bit slowly, but guess what happened after that? You guys have seen it. If you guys haven't seen the first three videos, there will be a playlist linked for the other videos. I will also be linking another playlist, which is our 2020 opening. I've mentioned it a few times, but I figure you guys might as well go back and check it out. It was good times back in the day. You know, it was early on in the channel, you know, our first year of real like success on YouTube. So we were, you know, doing some things, trying some different stuff. And Legacy Week was a really fun one, and I completely completely forgot that we ever did it until recently just like a couple days ago I was like that would be fun to do for the 200k so that's why we're doing it again we have crab turtle Tayo number two Ryu Ram we got Umiruka snake thing Heo Zanru will it be our first foil black illusion ritual let's get the combo and get the relinquished ultra rare as well first foil pulled and the metal fish a metal fish with a razor sharp caudal fin very nice all right, next up, Spell Ruler. I mean, who would have thought? It's all Spell Ruler. Pretty insane, right? Will we pull something crazy? One, two, three. We're going to be opening a lot of booster boxes of this soon, which is going to be really fun. A couple months away. Make sure to pre-order yours from a spat that... <laughs> I tried to say sponsor and sassy auto at the same time. The spassy auto. Ooh, the spassy answer. I don't know. <laughs> Russ recklessly. And we have Banisher of the Light. Pointy finger guy. Two foils. Not bad, but neither of them are that crazy. But hey, foils are foils. We'll take them. They're awesome. Spell ruler. Give us something amazing. We have a house of adhesive tape. Minar. Eat Gaboon. Poor rat. Poor, poor rat. Did it have a skull in his hand there? Don't think so. Turtle Oath. Eternal Rest. Darth Maul. 
Twin Long Rods, Numero Dos, Cyberjar, and a Magical Labyrinth. Cyberjar is a pretty nice one, but it's not a foil. I feel like that could have been a foil easily, probably like an Ultra. I mean, it's a great card. Don't know, but uh, you know, we'll have to see what happens. One, two, three, maybe one day. They will re- I mean, I think they already have. They've got an ultimate rare. We got Sion number two. We got Darkness Approaches. Ryu Ran, the egg guy. Very mysterious. He's got his little claws poking out right there. Umiruka. Snake Fangs. Okay, just Fang, though. It's just one of the two. So this the card is this one. Or is it this one? Or is it this one? Or is it Okay. <laughs> Terrell the Fickle. We have a giant rat with his skull and Mechanical Snail. Maybe he's holding a mechanical snail right there. You guys think? No, that's definitely a skull. Spell Ruler, come on, bless us with something good. So far, it's been pretty iffy for Spell Ruler. I mean, we're coming off an amazing Pharaoh Servant opening, so what do you expect? But, okay, I expect a lot, I'm not gonna lie. Crab Turtle, we have Slot Machine, where's the little brother? They're not next to each other in these reprint packs, so sad. Ceremonial Bell, we got Curse Fiend. Final Destiny, we've got Whip Tail Crow. Limbo Bamonga in the God Card decks, and a Molten Destruction. All right, really, really wait for something here. Blue Eyes Toon Dragon, uh, Servant Night Dragon, Relinquished, Toons, anybody? Anybody around here? We got Jig and Bakadon. We got a Toll, hey, hand it over. If you want good pulls, you gotta hand it over. That's what he's asking for. Fairy's Hand Mirror, The Fire, Kraken. Performance of Sword, pretty scary. We got Stone Ogre Grotto, Reliable Guardian, Horn of the Unicorn. Oh, and a delinquent duo, last pack, or last card of the pack, which sometimes makes it like sneak up on you. You're like, oh, it's a foil. Ultra rare delinquent duo, one of the best ultras in the set. So that is gonna really add to the value and see who can win Legacy Week. This is uh, boosted us up a little bit. All right, Spell Ruler, let's go. Delinquent duo is a big pull, big, big pull. Let's see if we can get a big secret rare, Mechanical Snail, we have Gaia Power. Fairy's Hand Mirror, Umiruka, Ceremonial Bell. Twin Long Rods, Numero Dos, the Horn of the Unicorn. This is what we got last time, and last time we got a foil. Let's see if that continues. Blue Eyes Toon Dragon Legacy Week comes through again. Secret Rare. Oh my goodness. This is insane. Only, did we have a Secret Rare in... We've pulled a secret rare in every video so far. This is pretty nice. I probably just jinxed us for Metal Red as LLB, but knock on wood wherever you are right now. All right, that wasn't even halfway, so we've gotten a couple of good pulls in a row. We're up to four foils, so we're on pace. Man, we could compete with Dark Christ in terms of number of foils at this point. All right, Guardian of the Throne Room, nice. Okay, so it looks like the uh, the horn gives us good luck. Koto Dama, we have Turtle Oath, Stone Ogre Grotto, the Reliable Guardian, Karate Man. We got Messenger of Peace. I didn't even realize that was a rare in front of that. Another foil, so we have five foils in the first 12 packs. What a great start. Five foils, we're on pace for 10, which would be the highest number of foils so far. And with the Blue Eyes Tumor, probably at decent value as well. Magical Labyrinth, you guys have seen already where we're placing at. Number two, we got uh, Slot Machine, no little brother. We got Umaruka. Spear Creed, a very annoying card if you're dueling. We got Whiptail Crow. The Giant Rat, and will there be a foil? House of Adhesive Tape. And not only that, he has eyeballs, which is creepy. All right, a lot of packs to go. Spell Ruler, fourth episode of Legacy Week. Hope you guys have been enjoying it. It has been really fun to record these, especially when you get crazy bulls. Weather Report. Uh, weather Report? Anybody gonna give us that? Electric Snake, we got the Peacock. Very, very, I mean, wow, creative. Talk about creative here. What does the flavor text say? A large peacock, never would have guessed, that launches its feathers and it's a lethal attack. Okay, it's an a lethal attack, cool. Turtle Bird, or Turtle Bird, Turtle Oath. Queen Bird, we got Recipe. We got Horn of the Unicorn. This has been a good sign before. Here we go. Oh, not that time. So we finally missed on a Horn of the Unicorn pack, but still, not bad. Many, many packs to go. Spell Ruler. What will we pull? One, two, three. We have Griggle, Gaia Power, Crab Turtle, Octoburser, Gravekeeper Servant. We got Darth Maul, The Waiting Orders, Twin Long Rods, Senju, and Mechanical Snail. Still many packs to go. Will we pull the epicness, the awesomeness? One, two, three. Come on. We have Toll, Slot Machine, Chain Energy, Dark Zebra, Ceremonial Bell. We got Boar Soldier, Spear Cretan. Amoeba, and will we pull another foil? That's another Jig and Bakadun. He likes hanging out in that last slot. Okay, guys, we have officially pulled, uh, you know, eh, 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 nothing in the second half. First half was great. One, two, three. Second half, turn it around. House of Adhesive Eyeballs. Tyon Numero Dos. Flash, Assailant. Watch out, he's flashing. 
Okay, maybe not. We have Giant Turtle. We have Hungry Burger. That's a play set. Snake Fang. We got Twin Long Rods, Numero Dos. The Giant Germ. And a Guardian of the Throne Room, the little brother. The little brother ran away, so he's no longer next to his big brother. He, is, he has run away to different parts of the box and pack. No foils so far in this second half of the box. Come on. Let's turn it around here. Rising Air Current. Let's rise to the occasion and pull a foil. Red Archery Girl. Electric Snake. We have Hungry Burger again. Ryu Ran. Commencement Dance. Spear Cretan. Nimble Mamonga and a metal fish. A metal fish with a razor star piccadle fin. Very nice. And speaking of very nice, I would, you know, would be really nice? A foil. That would be really, really nice. Let's try that. Foil time, baby. One, two, three, four. No, not four. What am I doing? Three from the back. All right, Sonic. I got a little carried away there. We got chain energy. Flash assailant. Watch out. He's not going to flash. He's going to assail. We have a uh, penguin knight. We have <laughs> final destiny. Whiptail crow. The giant of germ. We have upstart goblin wow we are on a little bit of a cold streak here this had potential to be one of our best openings now it's kind of going toward the middle with how you know long it's been since we pulled a foil one two three come on blue eyes tune here we go we got toll we got koto damo we got gaia power great keeper servant the dark zebra boar soldier spear cretin man send you the ten thousand and ten thousand hands i keep saying ten thousand and we've got oh 10,000 has blessed us with the blue eyes to number two. You can't make this up. Back to back legacy videos with the same secret rare twice. And not only that, it's the better one in both occasions. Okay. All right. Okay, double blue eyes tune. I even mentioned in the last video, oh, a double blue eyes tune would probably compete with this Jinzo. <sighs> Crazy. Insane. It, it's haters will say it's rigged. I mean, what can I do? We got a slot machine. We got the plasma zone. That was insane. I can't believe that. Curse Fiend, Boar Soldier, Commencement Dance. We have Nimble Among the and Liquid Beast. We're down to the last three packs of the video. It's been crazy. I mean, Legacy Week has been awesome. Our pulls have been really good. I think we're up to six foils in this one. We've got two secret rares. Very similar to the Pharaoh Servant opening, actually. Magical Labyrinth. We got the Crab Turtle. Tyhon Numero Dos. Umiruko with the Dolphin. We got the, notice how the dolphin's like, is the dolphin covering the sun or is it just like highlighted? I always thought this was the sun back there, but I feel like they just highlighted the dolphin. He's like, oh, look, a dolphin. Cool. We have Taylor of the Fickle, Stone Ogre Grotto, Heo Zanru, and the Forceful Sentry Ultra Rare. Another Ultra. I think that's seven foils. That'll eclipse Pharaoh Server in terms of number. We also pulled one of the best Ultras in terms of the set, which was Delinquent Duo. Man, this might have beaten out Pharaoh Servant for number one. Oh, wait, there's two more packs. So even if it hasn't beaten it out, there's still more chances. Wow, this has been a good opening. One, two, three. Spell Ruler, a.k.a. formerly known as Magic Ruler. We have Gaia Power, Electric Snake. We have the Penguin Knight. He's a little fuzzy for a penguin, you know, like a stomach and stuff. It looks a little fuzzy. Right, you ran. Are they fuzzy? I thought they were feathery. I don't know. Final Destiny, we have Snake Fang. Flying Kamikiri Numero Uno and a Griggle. He looks a little bit f not feathery, kind of more like flowery or leafy, grassy. I'd probably say grassy. I mean, he's Griggle and starts with a G, grass. I mean, that doesn't make any sense why that would matter, but that's what I'm saying. All right, our final Spell Ruler pack. This has been a crazy opening, guys. Legacy Week has been absurd. One, two, three. All right, Molten Destruction. I can't wait for you guys to see these. These are such good openings. I hope Metal Raiders and LOB live up to this. Minar, we have Giant Turtle who feeds on flames. Added again, Burger. That's number five. Cooking the burger. Nice. Stone Ogre Grotto. Too bad we don't have a HelloFresh sponsor right here. <laughs> we have Amiibo, but we do have the Goat Sassiato, who is the real sponsor of Goat. So go check him out. Yeah, 5% off for your booster box if you guys want to pull crazy like this. Sonic Bra I can't. I can't promise that, by the way. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel if you've enjoyed it, though, uh, because uh, two more videos like this. Hopefully the same level of pulls, maybe even better. Three secret rares, who knows? Shout out to Tone Fo Show, Daxer, JT Cho, Puffins of Doom, Ernesto Deanna, Dizzy, Micycle, America Deutzer, Supreme Sage 21, and then a tie show, Ian Musa, Junior Barding, Mimic Gecko, and Thomas McClain. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.